Hello Gemini, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Gemini, this is your reading for the month of Jan and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid. Gemini, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the video. Gemini, there is an extended reading for this one. The link for the same is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is a likely conclusion between you and this person. Coming back to this reading on YouTube, Gemini, we'll see uh, what you need to know, what is your energy, what is the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with or you will be dealing with. Right, so let's get started now. <clears throat> hmm. So, Gemini, what is your energy for the month of Jan? We have Knight of Swords. Okay. Then, Knight of Wands. The Fool. And we have Devil. Okay. What is the energy of your person? High Priestess, the Star, Six of Wands, and Strength. Right, so let me show you the cards, Gemini. Uh, Capricorn, Aries, Pisces, Aquarius, Leo are some important zodiac signs for you. For the month of Jan, this is your energetic spread. Okay. And this is the spread of your person. High Priestess, Star, Six of Wands, and we have Strength. This is the spread of your person. Right. So, Gemini, what is your energy for the month of Jam? Knight of Swords, Knight of Wands, the Fool, the Devil. With two knights appearing back to back. Okay. I feel that uh, I feel that you're going to have lots and lots of energy in the month of Jam. And also, there is a lot of excitement related to something. Okay, there is this excitement, there is this uh, a drive to take some kind of an initiative. Okay, now this initiative can be related to uh, your professional life. Like you probably may want to start some alternative business, alternative venture, um, additional source of income. You want to learn something. You probably are going to are going back to school, college, uh, enrolling for some online courses, enhancing your skill set. So either it's an a, a drive to initiate something new related to your professional uh, professional domain, professional area. Uh, for others of you, I see that. Maybe there is someone on your mind, Gemini, and you have a lot of feelings for this person and probably you want to, <clears throat> <clears throat> it's been long you are experiencing feelings for this person and you want to express yourself. There is something that you want to clarify. If you guys are, are already in a relationship, then I feel like there is something that is going on in your mind since a long time and you want to initiate some kind of a conversation like the intention to initiate this conversation uh, conversation is to get some clarity clarity about where this relationship is going clarity about uh is what is the future of this connection or is is the person holding any kind of intentions towards me or we are just dragging this connection okay so the if you are in a connection with someone then you want to do this uh 
this conversation with your partner with some kind of an intention related to your uh, related to your relationship if you guys are single probably you have someone on your mind uh, this may be applicable for some of you may not be applicable for all of you uh, you may be having someone on your mind and uh, you you are thinking of initiating some kind of communication with this person you want to you want to break the ice you want to get introduced to them so you may ask your friends to intervene you may be like hey can you like can you do something because of which we can get to know one another okay Apart from that, with the Knight of Swords and Knight of Wands, for some of you, this energy might be reversed, especially for people who are single. Okay, maybe there is someone who is interested in you and this person is pretty much eager to come towards you. Some Take some kind of an initiative. Uh, 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 maybe do some kind of a conversation. Break the ice is what I'm getting, is what I'm hearing again and again. With a Fool card, I'm also getting that there is also a desire to try and test something do some trial and error learn something or maybe uh, push yourself beyond your comfort zone okay with the fool card that's what i'm getting you are sort of trying to push yourself you're sort of trying to uh, challenge yourself if i may say okay maybe you're trying to challenge yourself like this is something new but i think so i should be doing it and even i don't know the nitty gritties of of this i still would like to do it take that leap of faith and let's see where i'm going okay so there is this desire to challenge yourself there is this desire to take some kind of a risk there is this desire to push yourself beyond your comfort zone okay desire to trial do some trial and error and you are not sort of worried about the outcome you are not uh, clinging on to the outcome you are not remaining attached to the outcome oh what will be the outcome is it going to be positive is it going to be negative i want a positive outcome only i can i won't be able to tolerate the negative outcome it has to work i won't be able to tolerate any kind of failures no you're not attaching yourself to the to the outcome you are in this trial and error uh, energy if it works works if it doesn't work let me try something else okay but there is this desire to push yourself beyond your comfort zone in the month of jan okay and because of the fact that we are we are in the first month of 2023 you are definitely <clears throat> What shall I say? Uh, you're definitely planning your year ahead. You're definitely thinking about how you want this year to conclude. What are the things that you want to achieve? What are the things that you want to do? Uh, should do I sh uh, should I continue doing whatever I'm doing already, or should I try something new? Okay, so is there something new that I'm going to learn in this year, 2023? So whatever this desire is desire to push yourself beyond the comfort zone that's a part of your checklist for 2023 uh with the devil card i see uh gemini that mm, you are going to meet someone and you both of you will be insanely sexually attracted towards one another okay uh, there is a strong possibility of you meeting someone and then there will be this instant attraction towards one another and there will be this instant desire to become intimate and physical there will be this instant desire to explore this connection there will be this instant desire to you know but there is there is an in, insane amount of uh, sexual attraction between you and this person whoever this person is what i see is <clears throat> if you get into a sexual connection with this person this person will remain at the top of your mind for a very long time 
okay like there is this hypnotizing energy and not just for you but this person will also experience the same thing even you will remain at the top of their mind for a very very long time okay like both of you will get hypnotized in this connection is what i'm getting okay there is this insane uh, sexual attraction and desire to become intimate and experience passionate moments with this person and they will of course also have a similar feeling towards you okay so i see that there is a possibility of you meeting someone and uh, uh, experiencing some intimate passionate moments with someone especially i'm also getting that if if you guys are virgin of or if you guys are following celibacy since a very long time this desire is going to be more strong okay uh and you will be like if you guys are following celibacy or if you are virgin you will be like i want to break this celibacy for the right kind of a person uh, only if i feel it from inside that i should break this wove of celibacy then only i'm going to do that and once you meet this person you you will really feel it from within that yes i want to break my wove of celibacy and i really want to be physical and intimate with this person and similar will be the case if you are virgin and doesn't matter whether you are following celibacy or not uh i see that there is this insane attraction between you and this person insane first of all there is going to be this instant connection and secondly there is a very strong sexual attraction between you and this person okay so let's see about your person we have high priestess star and six of wands and the strength i feel like the person with whom you're going to be sexually uh Uh, active the connection is not just limited to sexual attraction and experiencing passionate and intimate moments there is a lot to this person okay however i see that for both of you you guys will experience this strong sexual drive towards one another and maybe that is what you guys are meant to uh, that the the sexual thirst is meant to be quenched first and then i see a romantic connection happening between you and this person whoever this person is they are they are someone who is very ambitious someone who is very hard working and i see possibly they are a very uh, independent and self made Poss- uh, this person can also be a rags to riches person doesn't matter whether this is a man or a woman they are very hard working they know what they want in their life and they have worked very hard and they have achieved a lot in their life not that they have not experienced hurdles and setbacks they have of course okay but i also see that uh i mean what i'm hearing gemini is once you get to know the other side of this person their personality what are their what are they doing in their in their life and etc you will be really really shocked okay you'll be like wow i am dating a person with a substance i am with someone who is so powerful so strong plus someone who who value who has some values and principles in their life like i see you thoroughly getting impressed by this person okay so you may initially think that this is only limited and confined to sexual attraction but this is this is much more beyond that okay this connection is meant to experience a lot and next i see that you will get a lot more impressed by this person i also see that this uh, this person is someone who is very spiritual i'm hearing that this person is pretty much regular in doing their yogas and meditation there is a spiritual side to this person but they do not allow many people to know their spiritual side okay they they probably they are into the business world they are they are a corporate person sitting on a high position and uh, i don't know why i heard mergers and acquisitions this person probably does some big deals deals worth billions and billions of amount 
and uh, they they are a catalyst in executing those deals and and of course they are making some insane amount of money but then then they have this spiritual side and sexual side to them and then they have their original then they have their personality which is filled with a lot of ambitions which is filled with a lot of positivity which is filled with uh wanting to have right kind of people in their life okay so this person is they they love challenges they love uh soul to soul connection they love intimate uh moments in their life okay they they want to experience life fully okay and of course they know that they are they are meant to be with someone in this lifetime and this person will experience that soul to soul connection with you okay both of you will be insanely possessive about one another both of you will be in like possessive and obsessive about one another this person is wonderful gemini okay so i i see that you are about to have a, you are about to develop a wonderful connection with someone i'm happy for you guys okay all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment on below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care of yourself and have a great time ahead bye bye